What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about Zometica Corp, ticker symbol ZOM. This stock has a very important catalyst coming up in the next month, and we definitely need to keep a lookout for the run-up into this event and any continuation that we are going to see after. So we are going to go over everything that has been going on with Zometica since the last video that I put out. This stock has been going absolutely crazy over the last month, but we we have seen a very significant sell-off recently, and that is very similar to what we've seen with a lot of the penny stocks and hyper growth stocks that we have been covering on this channel. But if you have watched a couple of my other videos, I think that these are going to be great dips to buy, and these stocks are going to have a lot of great long-term potential. We cover Sensionics, Bionanogenomics, Nanodimension, Palantir, Neo, all of everybody's favorite stocks, and every one of those has been down a significant amount over over the past week and I think we are going to see a massive reversal coming in the next month once everything settles down. So the first Somedica video that I put out, I posted that around here. If we go over here, we can actually see that this was the video that I put out and we can see that Zometica was trading at about 97 cents and I posted this video on January uh, 17th. So coming back over here, we can see that Zometica peaked in the high $2 range. So if you were able able to get into Zometica when I was first making the videos about them. Congratulations on your gains. You are absolutely killing it. Now, before we get into all of the rest of the information about Zometica, make sure you go down and hit that like button and hit the subscribe button and turn on that notification bell if you want to be notified every single time I post a new video. Thank you to the 4,000 of you that have already done that. Watching my videos as soon as they are put out and showing love in the comment section, I really appreciate all of you. So if you didn't already know exactly what Zometica does, they are in the animal care space, in the animal medical care space. So if we come over here, they have this product called the True Forma, which is going to be released very soon. So True Forma immunoassays deliver accurate, reliable data when testing for thyroid and adrenal disease. Assay performance metrics to determine specificity and sensitivity were determined with the goal of meeting or exceeding the stringent testing standards found in in a reference lab setting. So they have a revolutionary bulk acoustic wave, BAW technology. Zometica is bringing innovative, non-optical fluorescent free technology to the veterinary world and your clinic with Trueforma. So essentially what Trueforma is able to do is it's able to analyze any illness that your pet may have in a very quick manner. So you can figure out what is going on with your pet at a very quick rate and the veterinarians that are taking care of your pet can actually decide what the best treatment option is and help your pet get better sooner. The way that I like to think of this company, even though it's a little bit of an oversimplified assumption, is it's like the bio-nanogenomic sapphire for animals. They are able to decide what is wrong with your pet sooner and are able to come up with better treatment options. That is pretty much the way that they are similar. Now, coming over here, we can see that Zometica has set March 30th, 2021 as the expected commercialization date for the True Forma. So they have not gotten this product out into the market yet. And and they have predicted that March 30th, 2021 is going to be the date that the True Forma products will be going out into the market. If we take a look deeper into this article, Zometica, a veterinary health company creating point-of-care diagnostics products for dogs and cats today announced that it expects to begin commercialization of its True Forma point-of-care diagnostic platform on March 30th, 2021. So they are going to be able to sell all of these True Forma platforms to veterinary offices around the country. This would create a lot of revenue for Zometica if they are able to get this product out into the market in a very efficient way. Protected by approximately 70 issued and pending patents, the True Forma platform uses bulk acoustic wave technology developed by QRVO to provide a non-optical and fluorescent free detection system for use at the point of care. BAW technology also used in cell phones and in the world's most advanced radar and communication systems is an extremely reliable and precise technology. That is a very good sign, especially when used in medical diagnosis. 
diagnostic products. Zometica believes that the True Pharma platform represents the first use of BAW technology in disorder uh, and disease state diagnostics. It certainly is a pleasure to be able to deliver such good news for our shareholders. That is what the interim CEO said of Zometica. So the diagnostic segment of the global companion animal market is expected to reach 2.8 billion by 2024 from 1.7 billion in 2019 at a 9.8% CAGR. Despite the effects of the pandemic on the economy, veterinary practice financial data estimates show that revenue in the United States for August 2020 was up 18% over July 2019. So this article was from a while ago, but it does uh, point to the fact that Zometica is still planning on releasing their true forma on March 30th, which would cause, in my opinion, either a very sharp increase in the share price or a sell the news event. But right now, I am leaning that Zometica is going to have a significant run up due to this event not being priced in anymore since the stock has had a very significant sell off in the last week. And I think that this Zometica dip could be a very good one to buy. Now, nothing I say in these videos videos is financial advice. These are for educational purposes only. I am just letting you guys know what I would do with my Zometica position. Zometica also just completed its most recent capital raise, so let's take a look at a couple of those details and see exactly what they are going to be using these funds for and the amount of money that they have raised. So if we come over here, Zometica announces full exercise of over allotment option by underwriter. That is usually a good sign. That means the underwriters actually took delivery of the additional shares that they were promised. So coming down here, a veterinary health company uh, uh, creating point of care diagnostics products for dogs and cats today announced that the underwriter of its previously announced public offering has exercised its full over allotment option to purchase an additional almost 14 million dollars uh, or 13, 14 million shares of Zometica at a price to the public of 190 per share less underwriting discounts and commissions coming down here we can see Zometica intends to use the net proceeds from the offering for the continued development of its diagnostic platforms including making milestone payments, if any, as they come due under its existing licensing and collaboration agreement. So we saw uh, that Zometica was actually partnering up with another company, QRVO, in order to make this true forma available. So they might owe some royalty fees to this company in order to start uh, producing and commercializing the true forma. And they were also uh, mentioned saying that they would be using the funds for strategic acquisitions if and when they become available. So Zometica has not identified any acquisition targets as of yet, but they are working to build up a good cash balance in case a good acquisition target comes around. Now, heading back over to my trading platform, we've seen an absolute bloodbath over this past week in the stock market. Typically, when we see some uh, a few names here and there go down 20%, it's usually a very bad sign. But when the overall market corrects a significant amount, that is a very good opportunity to add to your share positions in any stock that you want to have a bigger position in. Zometica, in my opinion, is a very good company for the long term, only if if they are able to get these uh, true forma products out to as many veterinary offices as possible and they receive great feedback from them. Either way, I still see a lot of upside for Zometica, especially with this significant sell-off. You can see that at the time we first started talking about Zometica, it was trading for just under a dollar and it peaked at, up around here at the 270 280 mark and it uh, sold off came back up and then sold off again on the uh, capital raise news and overall with the market so this is a very good dip to buy they were down 10 percent on the day that i am recording this this is going to be uh the day before you guys are seeing this since i am recording this the night before that i am posting it but we can see that after hours zometica is up three percent and we could see a big reversal in all of these smaller names, especially Zometica, if the overall market turns around and we see a lot of people put their sold off funds back into the market. So that is going to be it for this update on Zometica. If you guys enjoyed the information that I provided for you in this video, make sure you go down and hit that like button and hit the subscribe button and turn on that notification bell if you want to see these videos as soon as they are posted so you can stay up to date on all of your favorite stocks. Never miss any plays that I am giving you guys, especially like this 
this Zometica one that was up almost 250%. So that is going to be it for this one. I hope you guys are having a very profitable day and I'll see you guys in the next video.